All right, here we go. Just gotta slowly go in. Oh God, oh God, oh God. <laughs> it going everybody dragast here and welcome back to another episode of the best besieged creations today what the fuck are you guys doing did you just break your house okay i thought it'd be fun for these assholes to join me in a nice little skating rink here actually just randomly spawned here and i figured they were on it and they actually do kind of skate around they can't get to me they're trying to get to me right now uh but obviously with a frictionless environment it's not the easiest thing but yes, today we're gonna be doing some skating, so let's just go on to oh god, oh god, okay, this is this is weird, but let's just go on to here and look at this. We're we're just we're just a little skater right now. Did this guy fall? Are you, are you, did you die? Are you okay? All right, well screw them. Doesn't even matter because I am fucking majestic as you can see. So there's uh, certain ways you can um, lift your legs and whatnot. So let's try. Whoa, okay, that, that that's that's a little weird. Look at that. Oh yeah, we're we're doing lots of spins now. Okay, let's get that back up. Whoa, that was really cool. And let's try the other one. Okay, and that just kicks it that way. Okay, so <laughs> this is this is not accurate to ice skating at all, but it is definitely fun on this frictionless environment. Let's go see if I can bug this guy. What's up, you noob? Trying to learn to skate like me, being as majestic as me. I like how he can't even get to me. <laughs> I can't even get to him. Uh, steering this guy, damn near impossible. So I'm trying to get over to him. Hey, buddy. <laughs> But it's not the easiest thing. Oh god! Oh, watch out for this one. I just, I just love how I'm constantly spinning. Let me see. Let me see what we can do here. Oh, I can do a little jig. Look at that. Oh yeah! Look at those moves. Best besiege moves ever, man. <laughs> it's, it's so great. I love it. And I love that this guy keeps falling over. He actually did get back up, but he's pretty much given up at uh, trying to skate. I think. Let's just, let's just wait here and see, see, see what he does. Oh, there we go. He's he, he's back up, and is is he gonna fall again? I I don't know why they fall sometimes. I really want to run into them, but it's damn near impossible. All right, getting the hang of it. Getting oh god. <laughs> oh, the dangers of aggressive ice skating. Sometimes your head literally pops. Like I was saying though, I'm kind of getting the hang of it. You just really gotta kind of treat it like you're drifting. Oh, there goes my leg. <laughs> I can't. I can't fucking take this seriously. I was just ice skating. Now I'm going to fucking Uranus. This is great. You're also supposed to be able to actually go um, upwards. If you do, let's just try this button here, maybe. No. Oh, it's V. There we go. To infinity and beyond. <laughs> Not getting me this time, suckers. See you later. My people need me. Actually, let me see. Does it stop if I... No, it do... It just keeps going up now. I, I don't want... I want to go back down. I want to skate some more, damn it. Well, at least I can jig in the air. Look at that. Look, look at these skills. Michael Jackson, eat your heart out, bitch. All right, now I just want to try stupid shit. So we're at the ice skating rink in a storm here, quite literally. All right, so let's try... Oh, I can't even get up on the top of the thing. Let me lower this a little bit. Uh, that's about as low as it can go, hopefully. Uh, come on, get on the rink. All right, I'll just have to use mods to deal with you then. There we go. Now we got it in the ground. And can we skate? Yes, we can. Now, the big question is obviously... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can already feel it. can already feel it. This is, this is going to be the best experience ever. <laughs> okay. It's actually not pushing me <laughs> as far back as I expected. But still, obviously, a little dangerous on the ice. And now you know what it's like to skate in a hurricane. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just stuck. I can't even get off. All right. Let me just, uh, uh yes. Just, just say no, buddy. Just say no. Say no to drugs. Let's, uh, uh can't, I, can't, I can't even get out because I'm pushing too far against the wall. There we go. See you later, suckers. <laughs> Thank God. I love this game. All right. Don't know if this is going to work, but I thought I could skate with a lot of people. So we're on the final level of the game. Well, at least the current version of the game. And let's see... <laughs> <laughs> they all fell over. Okay, here they go. Oh, yeah, they are just going everywhere. <laughs> they can't get to me. Oh, this guy is flying. Okay, one's gotten to me, but he died. Oh, this is just too fun to watch. I don't even want to skate around. I just want to watch how, how these guys react to the frictionless environment. How the fuck are people on fire over here? Where did you even catch on fire? It doesn't even make sense. Oh, I think there's actual fires in the ground there, but... <laughs> This is great. Mind you, they have killed me, so I guess they are technically successful, but god damn, it's fun watching them. Like, they're killing each other. They're doing everything here. Okay, now for some more fun. We're just gonna put... We're just gonna put a bunch of bombs everywhere and make this a little bit more of a dangerous experience. And also, I lowered it so I can, in fact, 
go skating as well. So this should be pretty fun. All right, that should be enough. Let's try this thing out. Here we go. Bad things are going to happen really quickly, probably. There they... <laughs> oh, God. I didn't even make it a second into there. All right, I want to try again here because this is going to be really fun if I can do it. All right, here we go. Just got to slowly go in. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm trying to avoid the bombs. And there they go. Okay. Well, this was really freaking fun. I didn't expect ice skating to be so damn fun, but uh, in Besiege, pretty much everything is fun. Especially ice skating, evidently, and I don't think too many people are still alive. <laughs> oh, God. Who knew ice skating could really be so dangerous? Come on, yeah, hit that bomb. There you go. Good job, guys. I think we got all of them now. <laughs> There's not too many people alive. All right, so that was the ice skating rink. Didn't expect to spend so much time on it, but goddamn, it was fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed that one. All right, next up, we got this little cement mixer. Now, obviously, from a close inspection, you can probably tell there's something weird going on with this design. But from a distance, it actually does look like a pretty damn good cement mixer. Obviously, this is a transformer, though. So let's transform him into his second design here. And as you can see... It is a legit Transformers, so from a cement mixer to an Autobot, pretty cool. He can also fly with his uh, floating feet here. I mean, it's not really flying, it's kind of, you know, gliding with style. <laughs> Look at his little dance moves. Okay, let's turn that off because I'm worried about falling over because he has one more transformation that's really freaking cool. So we press this button and he transforms into a cannon. So this front thing right here, that's an actual cannon and we can, of course, shoot that if we want. That is just so cool to me. Now, I don't know, yes, unfortunately, oh, I think you can transform all the way back to the other thing, but I think I already broke it. Okay, let me just, let me, let me just try and get back to my cement mixer form. Okay, I'm all fucked up now. All right, well, that's the saddest cement mixer that I've ever seen, but you know what? It still works. <laughs> So yeah, this is made by the same guy that did that huge transformer that we showed in the back that combines multiples into one. I mean, he's just absolutely amazing at this stuff. And I love everything that he's doing. Let me use these feet again, because it's, it's really cool. He's actually floating just with steam power on his feet. And then, of course, down into sniper mode, and look at that. You can even aim it up at everything. Mind you, I'm not going to shoot at anything, but we can shoot that way. Perfect. Okay, and let's see if we can go back into... Car mode. Perfect. Okay. Still, uh, uh, I just, I just gotta, I just gotta play with my hands a little bit. There we go. And we're back. I think I missed piece of my so a piece of my side, but you get the idea. It works great. All right. Next up, we got. Well, I really don't know what this is because, well, it's made by a Japanese developer, and it is. First of all, let me just say, fantastic. There's a lot of unique features in this thing, and I, first of all, love the look of it as well. But yes, this is obviously a car. It's got some uh, pretty cool features on it. First of all, we can open the doors. Not that that's a really cool feature, but you can see inside the attention to detail is quite immense in here. And of course, we can close those doors after we're done. Now, the secret part is this jet engine in the back. We can actually lift this up, and inside is what the developer calls a spiral cannon. So you can rotate this as much as you want. You can actually rotate it backwards even to shoot it, which is really cool. It makes a... A weaponized, you know, sports car. That's not something you see every day. But you can turn on this thing, and it will launch a spiral cannon in the direction that you aim it. Now, it doesn't look like it does much damage, but let's actually... Well, let's go try and take down this tower right here. It should be pretty much effortless, so we'll try this out. All right, that should be aimed up. And turn this sucker on. There it goes. And I just love this thing. That's fucking awesome. Not only that, it's got some small cannons on it as well. I know there's one in the front and one uh, by the spiral cannon as well. So we'll try this out and see if we can get the shotgun to work. So, no, I totally missed everything, but you saw it anyways. All right, we'll, we'll just run them over instead. That, that, that's a little better anyways. <laughs> there we go. But yes, it does also have a little cannon on the top too. Oh, I thought it was with the spiral cannon. No, that's the cannon right there. You can actually see it. All right, just going to drive around here. Don't mind me, guys. Actually, it's not doing as much damage as I thought. Thought it would. It knocked down that tower with ease, but knocking over the peasant village, clearly not the easiest thing. All right, so we're gonna try it out on Duke's Please See how we can do here. Oh yeah, no problem at all. We're gonna destroy this thing. Let's just back up a little bit. It's actually, it's holding up quite well, as you can see, but slow and steady wins the race here. There we go. Yes, I killed a castle with a sports car. So yeah, honestly don't know what this one is. I don't know if it's based off of a movie car or anything. Again, it's a, it's a Japanese creation, so it's in Japanese. Uh, really have no idea about it, but I do really, really like this thing, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. 
All right, next up we got Battle of the Dongs with. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, that's even, that's what we're playing. You didn't even tell me beforehand. I, yeah, okay, well, we're going to be playing Battle of the Dongs, so the whole point of this one is to obviously not fall off the platform. So, die's on the left, I'm on the right. Now press one die, and now we can start. Oh so, my good God. luck. I, I'm. I'm. I... <laughs> Uh, and you can use don't don't forget G. You you got G. I'm <laughs> what is this? I can't even control. I can't, I can't, well, I think you have to wiggle. Yeah, you have to wiggle to really oh, get going gotta... there. There we go. Oh god. Turn, turn, turn. Oh. <laughs> get out of here! Don't do that. Oh, oh, there, there you go. There yeah, you go. You're, well, you're falling off. Oh my god. This is the how, problem. Is there's I, too much how friction. How do I move forward? I don't you, you have to w w wiggle. Just pretend you're a snake, because uh, you kind of are one. Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah. Just, what? just touch the dong. That's there we go. I'm gonna hit your balls. So hopefully, oh god. Okay, I now, now I'm too close to the edge. Uh oh. Uh, oh, what the fuck's going on? Yeah, no! <laughs> yeah, I win. <laughs> As I'm just flopping my penis around here up top, like, woo. Oh, my penis fell off. Herp, my herpes. It happens fell. to everyone. I, I just want, I just want to try to unpin everything just to see what happens here. Oh. <laughs> Oh no, the shaft attached oh from the Oh my god, balls. the leg. There's there's too much dongs on the screen. All right, final battle here. She won the first one. Uh okay, okay. Come on, just just get my got to get my Oh no, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, this is working way better yeah, this time. Stop. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh no, I'm going the wrong way. Come on, I'm still on. I'm still on here. Oh yeah, there we go. No, go 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 away. Go away. What no, you what go is my away. not steaming? No. <laughs> Simba. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, you're clearly better at this as, as well. Do I do Every one fucking more? thing, no. Uh, you've already won two. What? A best two out of three. I mean. <laughs> exactly! <laughs> Alright, something as equally as horrifying as the last creation, we got Tomb Stalker here. This is obviously a centipede creation here, and it looks absolutely fantastic. Look at that mechanism here. It looks like a real centipede. I love the look of it, but it's got a lot of tricks up its sleeve as well. All right, so first of all, let's turn this thing around. So I'm gonna start turning this way. We have to run this, unfortunately, very slow because once again, another big creation. Besiege doesn't like it when I play with big creations. So give, give me an hour to return, turn this guy around, and then we should be good to try this thing out. You can see he's got some uh, pretty interesting weapons on the front here. I wonder what they are. All right, I think I'm getting the rhythm going. It's all about the rhythm when it comes to big legged walkers like this. Uh, I, I was doing it a little too fast before, and as you can see, he slows down a lot. So if we just let his legs go all the way, as you can see, we are back to the front. So there we go. We can straighten out. I'm going to try and shoot these things down with a freaking centipede. Okay, first of all, let's go into attack pose so we can raise up a little bit here. That's about as high as I can raise, I think. I I'm, I'm a little bit sideways, so it's a little bit <laughs> heavy. Is... I, am, I am not the best centipede, clearly. All right, let's try that again. At least I'm straight now. So yeah, he's kind of got like a attacking position. That looks really cool, actually. So this actually might be aimed up. Let's try it out, shall we? Okay, so this actually has a laser beam mod on it. So if we shoot this, and yes, we've actually burnt the first one down. But actually, not only does it burn, if we let go at the right time here. Let's wait for this to attach. There we go. It actually throws a bomb at it at the same time as well. And that's why that one exploded. I probably should have went to a castle to show you guys that, but... uh Let's see if we can get the other one here. I'm going to turn my head a little bit, and bam. Turn on them lasers. Oh, yes. There we go. And <laughs> explosion. That is such a cool feeling. Now, this one already technically uh, totally charged, so we took that one down as well. You know what? Let's just try and take it down anyways, because this is fun. Now, you can actually control these lasers as well, so we can bring these up a little bit. Let's turn it on, see where I'm aiming at. Uh, yeah, we're just going to lower it a little bit. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. And, all right, raise it up, and bam! There we go. All right, he's not the best at aiming his lasers. Let's just wait for it. Okay, let's bring it down a little bit, maybe. There we go. Oh, God. <laughs> he's not the easiest to aim, but obviously he's got one of the coolest weapons in this game on him. Mind you, this laser isn't in the game, if you are curious. This is an actual mod you have to download uh, to get this weapon. So I'm trying to turn him back. He has a mind of his own here. Let's, uh, there we go, there we go, there we go. All right, there we go, and oh, I missed it. Okay, come on, just gotta try it again. Wait for it, wait for it. Bam! 
There we go. Finally, the hardest thing ever to aim is a centipede, clearly, but we did take down everything with this badass weapon. Let's go to a different map and uh, try and take down a castle, maybe. All right, time to strike from the distance. Let's see what happens here. Ooh, we're a little bit... Just gotta rotate it a little bit this way. There we go. <laughs> At least I, I think I caught some... Did I catch the birds on fire? I did. That is sadistic. Okay, the birds are crashing down. There we go. We hit the tower as well. Oh, that is just so freaking awesome. I love this creation. Very well done. Now, let's actually aim it towards the ground so you can kind of see what happens. It actually just explodes bombs, like, right away. So if we lower my uh, aimer here and turn on the gun here, uh, we'll do it for example right here. You'll see that just an explosion happens right away. And we lower it down to the guys, for example. And, uh, of course, it ignites them as well. But also, each side does have a bomb of its own. So it's a really cool design. Absolutely horrifying. And yeah, it's been a long time since we've done a legit mod. And that is, you know, one you have to actually alter some files with. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Loving these eyes, too. Those are actually tires. I just... The attention to detail on this one is amazing. This front mouth, up obviously, is a tire. And yeah, it just looks like an absolutely horrifying creation. But yeah, guys, we're going to end this one here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the best Besiege creations. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. And I will see you in the next one.